Yay! Yeah. Oh, we can have tuna tonight! Last time on Living With The Tide, we started our Atlantic crossing. Right, how are you feeling Tom? Ready for a bath. Crazy. <laughs> and this, uh, right, we'll see you in the Caribbean then Tom. Yeah, I've been long distance swimming, is that? <laughs> yeah. Just don't catch the fishing hooks. Yeah, yeah, don't. Whee! <laughs> 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 It didn't look as bad as we thought it was going to be. <laughs> you enjoying that? Go on, Matthew, explain our rig setup. You look like a child. We, we, why do I look like a child? You look like an excited child, not like I've that. I've got wing on wing. So we've got a reefed uh, main on the port side with a uh, jive preventer on it. And then on the starboard side, we've got the Genoa out fully out at the moment on a uh, spinning bolt so we've pulled it out so it's nicely held out so we can re reef it in if we want to the pole's set up on its own and uh, so we've got loads of canvas and we're making good speed we'll be there in no time You can lose almost anything in this world But my memory's there for me She said, sing me a song That'll make me smile so we've been at sea for six days, I think. Uh, Matthew's dancing behind the camera to smack that. There he is, I'll show you before I carry on. Crossing the Atlantic in style. We haven't caught a fish yet, our rods just keep tangling. But um, we're going to class this as halfway day, so by the end of today we'll actually be halfway across the Atlantic. It's been... Uh, Pretty nice, steady journey. Uh, Matthew got hit with a big squall last night. No rain, just 43 knots of wind. So uh, it sounded like, like a train or something going past in bed. But um, other than that, everything's going really well, I think. Are you enjoy I'll show you Matthew, we'll see what he has to say about our Atlantic trip. How's the Atlantic trip? Good. Are you enjoying yourself? I am, yes. Are you looking forward to landfall? I am, but I don't want to get there too soon. No. I want to enjoy it. <laughs> It's quite nice, we've got the rig set up on wing on wing with the uh, pulled out Genoa, it's working quite well. We're doing like seven knots? Yeah, six and a half, seven knots is the average speed. The other one will actually tell us our average speed, but I've not looked for a while. I think it's about 6.7 knots. And that's, doing good. that's Matthew's uh, take on today. Yep, and it's sunny.
Do you want this to turn the music down? Um, oh yeah, Matthew's turning the music down. Oh. Give us five seconds. There we go. We've all just swam across it, across the Atlantic. Yeah, all the way across. All we, the way we, across. We caught up with the boat. Yeah, we, uh, we're, we're all clean swimming. now. We're all smelling fresh so the boat doesn't stink anymore. Uh, I think Malou had a good time. She lost her pants, bless her. I would have done the same. I think we had boobs yeah. and bums out, to be honest. So uh, yeah, we're halfway, well, over halfway now. Should We've be another six days. 907 miles left. 907 miles left, so another six days, do you reckon? About six days, yeah. If we can keep up this speed, which we're doing like seven knots, so um, we should be there soon. Joe's the bottle then, Ronald. Oh, message in a bottle, halfway message. Donald Duck. <laughs> yeah, there's some messages from us all in there. We will uh, chuck this overboard and hopefully someone will find it. Probably us again on a beach in the Caribbean. Yeah, we'll probably find it on the beach, yeah. Hey, Paige, isn't that your Donald Duck? It was yours, but he's a sailor, so I thought he'd go in quite nicely. Yeah, it looks good. Do you want to kiss the bottle? Do as I. Hong Kong. Hong Kong, Hong Kong. Good luck, bottle. It's nice. Show me what you got. <laughs> I knew we should have brought better balls. Floating pretty good. Yeah. Off it goes. So we've just plotted the location of where Shackleton's ship, the Endurance, went down as we're currently listening to it on audiobook. It's there. A long way south of uh, Cape Horn. Pages. Best place to go down. No, it was Paige's idea. She wanted to plot it. Awesome. You're filming me and my hair's all over. I'm like a busted sofa. But Fair we've enough. got five days to go in the room. Barbados. Put it. Yay! Woohoo! Oh, get it in quick. Oh, I can have tuna tonight. Get mics. I can't, I'm filming. Oh, that was tuna. Maui, Maui. Is it? Oh, it's very colourful. Oh, awesome! Get me my knife. Uh, I get me the gaff. Oh, I'll get it. <laughs> I think you should start fishing then instead. Oh, oh shit! How big is it? That length of my forearm. Awesome! Oh, yeah! Nice! No, I think I've killed What's going on then, Tom? Prepping the fish. Today's catch. And it looks like we got some lemon and some stuff over there. Last um, lemon. Gin, Last lemon. And garlic and chili. Oh, excellent. And a tin foil house to put it in. I tell you, we're baking it. Did you say for about an hour? Yeah. So we're going to bake water there as well. Just All right. Yeah. Excellent. Good. Sounds good. What's going on, McDonald? Uh, Heidi came undone. Two of the bolts at the bottom and have undone herself. I've uh, just finished retightening. It's my own fault. I need to replace them with nylocks. Uh, it's just normal knots, and I didn't even put spring washers on because we didn't have any at the time. And I forgot all about it. So uh, it's a job to get some nylocks on there so they'll never come undone again. Well, now you're going for a swim. Now yeah, we're going for a swim now. We, that's just after we about to go swimming after we caught the fish. Noticed that Heidi was coming out. So fix that. Now I'm gonna try and have me swim. Third time lucky. Third time lucky. Welcome to Atlantic Studios. The sun is up, so let's get started. I can just walk down on me So I 
guess it's the last of her I've seen. She's whiskey, 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 whiskey. Step by step by step, she walked away. Leave me outside the bar just after it. Lipstick marks and stinking cheek. She said it was my fault, and I agree. Step by step by step, she walked away. How's it going, Captain? It's going well. We've got about two days left. Two full days, or uh, no, maybe two full days now. Two full nights, so. Yeah. And we should get there on the 12th after 14 days at sea. How's your adventure been on this sea? It's our longest crossing yet. Uh, it's been interesting. What's, your what's been your best bit about this sail? I don't know. Come on, Matthew. We caught a fish, that was good. We did some swimming. Uh, and loads of sailing. What's your worst part about this trip? Put up with you in bed. <laughs> How are you feeling, Ronald? Feeling good. 128 miles to yeah. go. Tom's making us flatbread. As we said, he's the chef on board. He makes all our interesting meals and everything, whereas me and Matthew can only right, make yeah, nachos. It's been a lifesaver because we normally just eat fajita wraps and it'd yeah. be a bit of a shame that the last week we'd have no chicken left, so it'd just be. Raps. 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 <laughs> Raps. <laughs> but yeah, and I think Tom's gonna stay with us until Antigua. Yeah, that'd be good. Uh, maybe he probably will stay for the rest of his life, but uh, <laughs> we're saying Antigua for now. <laughs> no, we need to find work. Yeah. We'll see what we can. We'll have him busking. <laughs> yeah, busking every time. <laughs> Land's in sight now. God, I look knackered. I've only just got up. We're. Uh, if I show you on the plot. I don't know if you can see. It's a little boat here. It was, not with the sun. Yeah, the sun's probably too much. But there's a, yeah, we're, we're super close now. Matthew's just taking us over some turbulent seas, aren't you? Yeah. We're not even going to be turbulent. Hey. We're bouncing there's around no a little bit. There's no westerly set. Oh, right, there's no westerly set, so it shouldn't be uh, turbulent. But yeah, after 12 days, is it now we've had at sea? 14. 14? Yeah. Oh, after 14 days at sea, we can see land. I Two think everyone, everyone will be very happy about that, so I'm happy. I can't wait for some chicken. Bridgetown Harbour Master, Bridgetown Harbour Master, this is Yacht Nova, Yacht Nova, over. Yacht Nova, Bridgetown, Good morning uh, Harbour Master, we've just arrived from Atlantic Crossing and uh, after permission to enter the customs dock or shall we anchor off, over. Now to come to the harbour to get your clearance at Immigration Customs, over. Roger that, I'll proceed to the customs dock, over. Oh, roger that, stand by. Many thanks, out. After clearing customs, we anchored in Carlisle Bay. Has the, uh, was the Atlantic crossing that bad you've shaved all your hair off again? Yeah, yeah, I'm having a breakdown. No, I just couldn't be bothered to do it while we were rocking, so it's uh, reset in oneself, back to normal. I need the hoover now, and now I need to do the, uh, the Close shave. Matthew's on to his close shave, but it's also pancake day, mm -hmm. and Tom's making us pancakes. We had to uh, actually go and buy a cup of milk off of the locals last night, so, uh, yep. Bar order. <laughs> Matthew, your big head's in the way now. <laughs> so there's Tom making our lovely breakfast, and we'll do a shot of us all. Uh, Mike and Malou left us yesterday to continue their adventure. I'm going to turn this camera around to film me. 
So it's just us and Tom now. Um, we've got to tidy the boat, we've got to repair the mainsail and do a few other jobs and bits and catch up on messages and then we can explore Barbados. Pancakes eaten, Matthew's going for a bath. Got me hair. Oh yeah, he has, he has had a bath beard. in his uh, in his pants. <laughs> and Tom's going in. Where are you going? You're going to jump in? When? Now? In a minute. I'm just going to the bottom. So I'll... Uh... I'm going with my snorkel. Oh, you, you're, you're both going to jump in together? Oh wait, well then you can chuck me And then out. I'll chuck the snorkel to you. What are we going for? Oh, are you going back? <laughs> oh, I'll you go on. Way. I'll go carry him ball this way. Hang on then. Okay. One, two, three. It was like Shamu then, Matthew. They'll be having you at Sea Life Centre in America. <laughs> Here they come. Matthew's pointing at something. Don't know what he's pointing at. Swimming in his pants. That's how sailors wash. Oh, down he goes. It is like watching the whales at uh, sea, Lyle, sea World. Especially when he spurts it out the snorkel. Don't know what he's looking at. Ah, he's looking at the rudder. Now he's off to look at the anchor. The wind's chilly, it's warm in the water. Up? He's back out now, he's up here. Oh, yeah. That's crazy one. Matthew, go away. No, no, let I've me. Got, I've got your pee. <laughs> no, <laughs> let go, let go, let go. This is Nova. <laughs> He might die, there's nothing down there. Oh, you all right? The boys are at the back doing the laundry whilst I clean inside. And Matthew's got a towel on his head. I'm going to have to show you him in two seconds. How's it going? <laughs> What's with the towel? Keep me dry. <laughs> Matthew's pants are blowing in the rain. They're gonna fly off and stick on some poor soul boat. It's proper raining. Join us next time for high fives, fish fry and wreck exploring.